What's up, everybody? Welcome back to BCG Plays Uncharted Drake's Fortune. My name is Barry Courtney, as you may know, and we're continuing our journey through the Uncharted Nathan, Nathan Drake collection. It's telling me hints of where to go, because I've been lingering around, around here too long. And I, I'll show you why. I'll show you why I've been lingering around. Look how he fucking walks upstairs. Look at this shit. <laughs> I know where to go. Shut up, game. And then, look. He's not even touching the f steps. He fell into the stairs. And look how he runs downstairs. Like, that's not a normal way. What are you doing, Nathan Drake? I know where to go, game. Shut up. Alright. But that's why I was lingering around here a lot before, uh, before I started up uh, the Let's Play. Alright. Which way do we go? Oh, I know. It's this way. There's people. There are people waiting for me. <laughs> yeah. See. Told you. Hey, I can shoot him in his head. Nope. Oh, did I get him? I got him a little bit. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, fuck, I ran out of... See, the reason I why I prefer the, uh... Okay, I think I got him. <laughs> Let's wait just a couple seconds. Yeah, we're good. The reason I prefer the pistol... Usually... Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Fuck you! You square? Sorry, I was watching Jane Silent Bob last night. That's where I got that quote. Jane Silent Bob strike back. Specifically. If you're confused about that. No, I want fucking... See, the reason I, I prefer the pistol is because I feel like it's much more accurate and you don't get a lot of recoil. That's why I prefer it. And I remember this part confusing me last time, too, of where to go. <laughs> I think I just continue along this way. But then how do I climb up here? Hmm. Hmm. Alright, just over here. We got all the grenades that I need. Maybe I go back that way? <sighs> we might be here a while, kids. This is a this will be a fun wrap up for the first week of Uncharted Drake's Fortune. Oh maybe Oh here we go. There we go. Oh, poor guy. Blew him up after I killed him. Now his family won't have a body to bury. Ha ha ha. No, that's a little fucked up. Oh shit. I I remember this part vividly. I remember vividly hating it. Place could use a good plumber. No oh god. See, where did they all come from, Nathan? And with the pistol, you know, like I I feel very comfortable being able to you use usually only one shot for each guy. I don't feel like I'm wasting a lot of bullets. Oh god. Yeah, I'm gonna fucking die. I'm already dead. Yep, there you go. Died within the first five minutes. There you go, kids. Total headshots. Oh, I'm coming up on you, Nabashin. Or as Colin and Greg like to call you, Nabshin. Yeah, I notice. I notice every time you ask a question on that on that show. If you don't know what Colin and Greg Live is, twitch.tv forward slash kinda funny games. Every weekday. At eleven AM Pacific Standard Time. There we go. I beat I beat your score, Nabashin.
Oh, my headshot game on point, son. He just shot through that pillar. That's bullshit. You're cheating. I don't like cheaters. We're gonna blow you up. There you go. Oh, what? How did that not work? Yeah, fuck you. You're dumb cheating. You're just a you're just a filthy cheater. You pirate. Oh, pirates are cheaters. They're pirates. One of the my favorite moments in Pirates of the Caribbean. Fuck, I really want to watch Pirates of the Caribbean now. Holy shit, where did these guys come from? Oh my god, I'm dead. Yep, see, this is why I don't like this part of the game, because the guys start popping up in areas, and they don't, the game doesn't let you know that they're coming. But, man, I really want to watch Pirates of the Caribbean now. Because one of my favorite moments is uh, when, in the first one, when Donnie, uh, no, Johnny Depp, sorry, I can't fucking talk anymore today. Um, when Johnny Depp is fighting Orlando Bloom, right? Can we get a confirmation on that, uh, Shimoda? Orlando Bloom, am I remembering that correctly? Yeah. Cool, thank you. See, ah, fuck. They blew my cover over here. Just fucking kill me already, yep, there you go. This episode is gonna be a... Gonna be a bunch of, uh... Just gonna be a bunch of dying, bunch of death. All right, I'm not holding back this time. Not trying to get all those perfect headshots anymore. The game's bullshit now. But yeah, one of my favorite uh, parts of uh, the Curse of the Black Pearl is when Johnny Depp and Orlando Bloom are fighting in sort of the beginning and it's like a, a really well um, blocked fight scene and at the very end Johnny Depp pulls out his gun Orlando Bloom's like you cheated Johnny Depp's like pirate I'm a pirate dude what we do we're fucking we're skeevy motherfuckers alright and I think they start coming through over here yep See, that's what fucks me up, and they didn't let me know that those guys were coming that way. Uh, this is where I'm gonna... Since I'm more prepared, I'm gonna go back to my pistol here. <laughs> I think I just beat, uh, Andrew from Comics and Joysticks and Total Enemies Defeated. See, I wish it would... Like, it's telling me every time I pass someone else, but, like, I wanna know when I hit, like, a hundred spot, you know, because I don't think it told me when I, holy shit, where did that guy come from, okay, that's cool, thanks game, thanks game for letting me know that, fuck you, and fuck you, sir, fuck you kindly, nope, not today, buddy, not to fucking day, Alright, guys, let me know. Has the music stopped? Because that's the only cue I get in this game that lets me know. Oh, well, I put I put away my gun, so that's a good cue. That's another cue, I guess. Where's this fucking ammo? Alright, here we go. But yeah, I, I guess I just beat uh, Andrew from Comics and Joysticks. Go check out his stuff. And his group of nerdy people. You can check him out on YouTube. And SoundCloud. And Nabishin is also from uh, Irrational Passions. He's one of the many beautiful people on that show. How the fuck? There, yeah, more ammo for me. From my favorite gun. Now, how do I get up there? Or am I supposed to get up there? Am I supposed to go somewhere else? I think that's my destination, right? <laughs> Ooh, that was weird. I had a cough and then I burped at the same time. That was a very weird sensation, people. I do not recommend it. Oh, oh all right. I feel like I just cheated the system. I don't know if that was the correct way of me going. But we'll fucking accept it. All right. Alright. Like 
the salmon over here. Start pulling this thing. All right. I I sent a trap. No. Oh, oh all right. Okay. All right. Swing around. Swing around. Swing around. Feel like they're. Do I start over here? I think so. Let's try it. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta fill up the water so I can go up. See, that's the thing. It's like, that's not really a puzzle. Yeah, it reminds me... A lot of these puzzles remind me of the, the puzzles in Ocarina of Time. <laughs> just gotta find the thing. You just gotta look around the room and be like, Oh, that's the, that's the thing I gotta use. God damn, that water is pretty. That's some pretty water in a game. That's when you know you got a good game going. When your water looks pretty as fuck. I don't know if it's a good game, but it's a damn fine looking game. Now, the actual effects of the, him splashing through the water aren't so great, but I feel like that's just the limitations of the time. Water effects weren't really super great or outstanding until Assassin's Creed Black Flag. For me, at least. That was like one of the last games for the uh, 360 PS3 uh, generation. Well, not one of the last. <laughs> but it was in like that last year. I just remember it being very... Like the... It was a day one game for PS4. I remember it not being... That old, like it was still pretty new, the game itself. All right, <laughs> gotta go up these stairs. Uh, chapter six. How many chapters are there? I should have looked it up in between hoarding let's plays, but I didn't because I'm not smart. I don't think that way, guys. I just live in the here and now. All I do. Jesus, Elena, where are you? Yeah, Elena, the fuck are you? What? So important about that tower. Oh, right, 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 right. Oh shit! How does he? How is he not dead? Just took like four bullets in the chest. I know it's video game logic. I know. I fucking know, guys. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. I think that's it. I think that's all of them. Let's go. Alyssa Shimoda is in the, is in the background. She's working on a bunch of schoolwork. It's report card season. So if you're watching this, kids, make sure to Stop buy it. No, just make sure. So what you do, kids, here's my advice. Before your teachers start writing up report cards, make them brownies. Whatever. They're way smarter than that. No, they're not. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have said that. Would you care to explain your, um, your meaning there? You're very pretty. You're the pretty. No, I'm sorry, you're I'm you're the. About the no, they're not. <laughs> Let me clarify my question for you. It was joking. I was joking. No, I know. I know. I'm just saying, a good teacher. Oh yeah, no. Only shitty teachers would take bribes. So kids, I mean, a good, kids, so, no, kids. No, no, listen, a good teacher will take your brownies, but still um... give is still give you a, <laughs> a fair grade. Yes. <laughs> Or actually, I should say a smart teacher. That's what smart teachers do. I really I your bribe. And I reward you nothing. <laughs> I have a question for you. What is your question? I'm going to write um, a sample so, essay. And you want to put it on our website, BayazonaGamers.wix.com? Yeah, I can. <laughs> I want to put it. It's for my kids. <laughs> 
They're yeah. writing about animals, and I want to show them an example. Okay. What animal should I do? Panda? Now, in the theme of Uncharted, yeah. I was going to say a dog. Because the developer is Naughty Dog. Oh, too basic. Yeah, that, but that was the thing. I was like, oh, that's not interesting enough. So now I'm not too sure. Is a bandicoot an actual animal? Is that real? I don't know. I think they are. Let's look this up. That's an interesting question. Let's say, let's, we're going we're gonna to stop this, uh, we're going to put this Let's Play on hold for a second. Let's look up if bandicoot, I feel like they are. I feel like they're an actual bandicoot. Oh, they're marsupials. Yeah. Cool. You should do Bandicoot, because Naughty Dog also made Crash Bandicoot. There you go. Okay. Do it. So you can show them an example, like a writing sample, and also still teach them about something new. Yeah. There you fucking go. I should be a teacher. I would nail that shit. No, not really. All right, can I jump this way? Oh, I can. Okay. See, it's just weird camera angles like this, where you, you have... It's very hard um, for me, at least, uh, just the depth perception of what I, where I can jump. Oh God! Who? That would have killed me. <laughs> I feel like enemies pop up in this area, but I guess not. I guess I am wrong. Dude, what kind of fucking angle is this? What the fuck? They were learning. I know. They're just they're coming straight off of ah fuck. See where was I supposed to go? That ca the the camera angle there was not complying with me. Not showing me the way. I know this would be an interesting camera angle for like maybe a movie. Oh, I'm supposed to go up here, I think. There we go. Oh god. I wonder if I just stayed on those crumbling rocks, if they would just wait for me to move. Because I feel like that's what, it, what, what would uh, actually happen. Uh, we'll, we'll try it out the next time. No, actually, oh, fuck. Run, Drake, run. Ah, what? What kind of shit was that? I was trying to try to jump. What? What am I supposed to do? What? What am I doing wrong? Oh my god! There we go. Ah oh man, I feel all stuffed up. Not a good feeling. Weirdly enough, a feeling I feel like I get almost all the time whenever I do let's plays. Very weird. Whenever I start the let's play, I yep, not feeling good. Not feeling the. Oh! Did not real. Uh, shit. Excuse me. Oh, gross. Skeletons. See, he's all like weird about like death and shit of like skeletons. Because he's obviously got a thing about like. What the fuck? Oh my god, alright. Thanks, thanks, game. See, they... They know you... <clears throat> they know they should probably have reloaded the game there, because they know that this climbing down rope shit is a bunch of bullshit. It's our second time. How? I'm right there. Oh my god. See, this game is just... What the fuck, man? What in the actual fuck? It's not doing it at the right angle? See, no. What am I supposed to do there? The fuck kind of bullshit is this? 
Maybe I press X instead of circle? Oh, nope. makes me jump. Oh, I was just supposed to walk towards the fucking rope. Thanks for, thanks for that clarification. Right, so what's the point of going over here? I feel like there is supposed to be a point to all of that, right? I'm not crazy, am I? So where do I go now? Oh, do I go over here? It's over here. Hello. Ah, see, look at how fucking pretty this game is. The landscape here is fucking awesome. Look at that mansion all the way over there. Fuck even is that? Oh, I know what that is. I know. Am I supposed to go over here? Doesn't seem like it. Why can't I remember what to do in this game? <clears throat> I feel like that building was important for some reason, and now I can't... Fuck, dude. <laughs> oh, is that not a high enough drop for me to die? No? I just thought maybe, you know. You never know. Huh. I'm very confused, people. Very confused. Good amount of this Let's Play has been doing this shit. Now I don't know what to do. Ho! Oh. I definitely have to go up here. It's the only way I can go. But then there's no... Oh, that wasn't it. Maybe I gotta look this up. No, it's, just, it's gonna start me all the way back here again. Excuse me. What is the point of this area? Oh, I've got the keys. I picked up keys. Alright. No, I... <sighs> Fuck. Fuck, Nathan. What the fuck? Oh my god. Most of this, most of this, uh, episode has just been dying. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, people. It's not my fault. I'm like Lando Calrissian right now. It's not my fault. There we go. There we go, buddy. Oh, I remember where to go now. I'm being a fucking idiot. I picked up the keys... There's a door over there that I gotta open. Thanks. Thanks, people, for letting me know. Thanks for thanks for the help, audience. Like you could have told me in real time while I'm recording this. Right? There's a door over here. Is it this door? Nope. That's a gate. Is it over here? Yeah. Okay. There we go. <laughs> what? Oh, there we go. Okay. I was about to say, well, what fucking door am I supposed to open? I feel like there are bad guys down this hallway. And this seems like the kind of hallway where they just start randomly popping out of these corners. But I guess not. Anything over here? Anything? Anything? No. Bueller? Bueller? Anyone? Anyone? Bueller? No, I feel like there is there is some sneakery going on over here. I don't like it. I don't like... Yeah, where is she? Where is Elena? It's all bullshit. We better find Elena in this fucking Let's Play today. I don't want to let these people down. No. We gotta go through another firefight. I can tell. It's pretty obvious. How did they know I was there already? Alright, hopefully that'll go far enough. No, it did not. Okay, thanks. Thanks. 
Oh, that's a cool tip. If you want people to leave, like, uh, turrets, uh, just shoot around the turret, and then they'll leave. That's pretty cool. I did not know that. That feels like a... Like a, a tip that Uncharted fanatics would know. And I'm just discovering it now, so please don't hate. Only my second time playing this game. Someone shooting from me? What the fuck is going on? I feel like someone's shooting at me from up there. What the shit? What the shit? I don't like this. I'm like Ron Weasley right now. Going into the Forbidden Forest with all the spiders. I don't like this. Harry, I don't like this at all. I can't do it in the British accent right now. I'm sorry. I'm too stuffed up. To even... I'm way too stuffed up to even fathom trying to do a terrible British accent right now. Come on. Let's find Elena today, guys. Let's do it. Shit. <sighs> Alright. We're not dying again. Not today, guys. We're not dealing with any bullshit rope. Bullshit. Bullshit rope. Right, I need to pronunciate my words better. I don't know if that's if that's all of them, guys. I really don't know. You're the ones listening to the game. I can't hear it. You gotta let me know. Is the music over? Are they all are they all dead? Did I kill them all? I mean, I've only already killed 800 people so far. Alright, I think I go through here now. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. I'm really stuffed up. It's allergy season. Alright, now this is the hallway, I think, where they start popping up. <laughs> see this devious ass hallway? See? I fucking told you. I fucking told you. Right when I popped out. Right? Right when I said the thing. Shit. <sighs> Come on, let's try to find Elena today. Let's, let's do it. I'll even extend the let's play a couple more minutes. Just to try to find her. Because if we don't find her today, you guys are going to have to wait all weekend before we can find her. Holy shit! How come you didn't pop up before? You're a dick. I mean... I guess that was... Pretty obvious already, because you're a pirate. Pirates are usually dicks. Don't come out and wait a second before you shoot, you dingus. Word of the week, people. Dingus. It's like Sesame Street. But with guns and wearing. And the word dingus. More ammo. Yeah. Yeah. More people over here. Any more? Any more? Anybody want to talk some shit? Talk shit, you get shot. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, now we get to use the turret. Boom, motherfucker! Is that it? Was that, was that everyone? That wasn't that interesting. Oh, here we go. Ah! Ah! I feel like there should be more people coming at me. I do have a turret. Ah! I'm a madman with a turret. 
Do not fuck with me. Is that it? Is that all the fun I got to ha get to have with the, the, the turret? Well, if that's it, then. We're blowing that thing up. Blowing that thing up. I think I have to come back here to fight more guys, so that was probably not the smartest idea. I probably should have kept those, just in case. Whatever. We're having a fun time. <laughs> we have we have fun here at BZG. You know, Tim, he brought bagels. <laughs> what a crazy guy. That is not my joke. That is Henry's joke. Just to credit Henry. Henry made that joke one day. On one of our shows. I forget which one. Oh, this shit looks shady as fuck. I don't like this. I do not like this at all, man. Was I about to be Tom Hawkins? Is that what that said? Tom Hawkins, I'm coming for you. Find uh, Tom Hawkins' new show. Uh... Oh, you're about to give me a hint. Give me a hint. Give me a hint. Why do you only give it... Uh, uh... Is it this part? There we go. Am I supposed to go over here? Ah, uh, okay. I was supposed to pick that up. Anyway, I forget what his like the YouTube link is. But look up uh, Tom Hawkins on YouTube. He has a new show on the weekends called um, Tea Time. It is like sort of one man talk show where he talks about all the current affairs in video games. Very very fun show. If you are a fan of adorable British men drinking tea while talking about nerdy shit, go check that show out. It's pretty dope. But not until you finish this episode, damn it. All right, come on. What? Did we just come out the fucking same... Weren't we just over here? That must be Drake's tower. Ugh. She's probably all the way over there, isn't she? Oh, fuck. All right, well, let's... Oh, my God. Yeah, I beat Tom Hawkins. There we go. Beat him at his own game every weekend, tea time with Tom Hawkins. I don't know if it's Saturday or Sunday. I'm not too sure. It's a fun show, though. Check it out. All right. <laughs> Let's try to make it to Sir Francis Drake's Tower, and then we'll end the episode. I know I'm going a little longer than usual, but it's Friday. We're having fun. Check out BCG News. I'm sure it was a great episode. Hopefully, Netflix and Chill came back. I'm not too sure. Depends on if uh, what's coming to Netflix in the month of March came up before uh, we had to record it. Um, do I go up here? Seems like I would go up here. But if there is no Netflix and chill uh, segment this week, you can rest assured. Am I using that right? I don't think I'm using that right. You can be rest assured. No. You can rest assured that there will be a Netflix and chill segment next week. Where did she go? Ah, uh, fuck. Where did she come from? Where did she go? Where did you come from? There you go. Thank you. Why well, I love you. See, and now you get this bullshit weird angle where. Holy fuck. Like, how was I supposed to know to jump? Oh, what the fuck? That was some horse shit. Because <sighs> I told people to stay on my show before they went to Tom Hawkins' show. I don't like that. The universe telling me to tell people to go watch Tom Hawkins' show now. <laughs> oh, God. All right. 
Special Friday episode. We're going a little longer. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, my. So I, I know I said I wanted to test the theory of if I just stay on the crumbling things that they'll just stay there for me until I leave. But I don't want to. I don't want to take that chance right now. We're so close to finding Elena. I think. I'm not too sure though. Come on. <laughs> Fuck. She's not here. Where is she? Ooh. Yes. So what were you looking? For? <laughs> what were you looking for, Sir? Dr uh. Fuck. I can't talk today. Sir Francis Drake. Mansion. Huh. The ship's never left. Elena. Ah, uh, there she is. Hey, he said what I said. Oh shit. Oh god. I guess that's not how I was supposed to. Oh. I I guess that's just how that happens then. Damn. Damn, dude. Trying to rescue you as a matter of fact. Oh, that's so sad. Yeah, I was trying to help you out. Fucking Elena. Sandstone brick and stucco. Speaking of fucking Elena. How do you get to know so much about this? How do you guys uh think um the relationship is going to work out in Uncharted 4? Yeah. It'll just take a tug to pull these bars out. What? No, wait. I'm not too sure. Because I'm not as, like, as heavily invested in his relationship with Elena. Whoa! Hey. Great. Daddy Raja. <laughs> I just might let you live. <laughs> Is that it? Is that my deal? Die now, or help you, and die later. That's oh, a tough call, but you know what? I'll take die now. Damn. Listen to me, maggots. I was promised treasure on this goddamn rock. And now, my men are dying. They can't even go outside to take a piss without an armed guard. And I have nothing to show for it! Yeah, because I'm killing them all, bitch. <laughs> I am making you a fair offer. You help me find the treasure, and the last man alive gets the gold. And the girl, of course. The girl? Oh, Eddie, the girl's long gone. She's probably off the island by now. She's going for help. Dai Kuching, you were never very good at poker. I will find her. How much trouble could one girl be? That much trouble? Ha. See, it's funny, guys. It's funny. No, it actually I'm I'm teasing it. I'm teasing the game like it isn't funny, but it actually it actually is pretty funny. Alright, this is where we're gonna we're not gonna end it right yet. Right yet. But this is the last portion. We're gonna do this fun ass uh car thing. And then we're gonna close out the show. Whoa! Oh shit! Out of the frying pan! We're already on chapter seven! How many chapters are there? Oh my god! Blowing shit up! People are on motorcycles! But they're not motorcycles because they have three wheels! What the fuck are they? I'm not really sure. Holy shit, that car blew up! What are they, motor. Tricycles? Is that what they are? I don't know, they don't have four wheels, so they're not like... Oh god. This one's coming in hot. Oh shit. I can also fire explosives. That is good to know. But not as often as the, the turret gun thing. The gun that goes really fast. Ah, he he drove into a tree. Oh, are they? Are they now? 
Fuck. Yeah, fuck you guys. Oh, oh god. Oh my god. Oh jeez. Oh my. Oh jeez. Oh my. Yeah, Tom Hawkins. I beat your total enemies defeated as well. Tea time with Tom Hawkins every weekend. Every Saturday, I believe. I think it's every Saturday, and then he does a Let's Play every Sunday. I could be wrong. But I think that's how it goes. See, that, that's how much... Uh, oh, shit. Am I about to die? I don't want to... About to... I don't want to do that right now. That shit sucks. I want to do this segment all over. Oh, God. He straight up ran into that. <laughs> I swear, Tom, I do watch your show. Don't be mad. I'm just not as familiar with your scheduling because you're... you're you just started it. Oh, God. That's a cliff. You don't want to drive off that. Oh, 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 jeez. Oh, man. Now we gotta go towards the danger. Yeah, oh, that's cool. That was a cool shot right there. Oh, fuck. More people. See, that was a four-wheeler. But these ones, they're like... What the fuck do you call those? Oh, more explosions back there. The game defeating itself. Oh, they just popped out of fucking nowhere conveniently. Oh, jeez. They were just sort of hiding out there. What were they doing? They were probably jerking off. Those pervert pirates. Yeah. Whew. Ho ho. Oh, more guys. Oh, there we go. Now, it's segments like these that are really, really fun. Oh, oh God. What's about to happen? Holy shit. Oh, God. That was scary. See, it's parts like these that make the running towards the screen and bullshit parts like that totally worth it. Holy shit. God, this game is so suspenseful. Yeah, the immersion is lost because I was wearing the Naughty Dog shirt and now he is just wearing his regular bullshit shirt. What happened in games where you could, like, change clothes and it would still work in, like, in the cutscenes? Because simple games like Tony Hawk's Underground 2 could do shit like that. Come on. And those games were on the PlayStation 2. Yeah, he's fucking crazy. He reminds me a little bit of Tuco from Breaking Bad. <clears throat> the best TV show of all time. <laughs> yeah, come get it, buddy. Whoa! Right into the water. That's dangerous, kids. Don't try that at home. Alright. Thank you guys so much for joining me this entire week playing Uncharted Drake's Fortune. Uh, join me next week to play some more uh, Uncharted, Drake's Fortune, uh, maybe beat the game, because I feel like I'm going through it pretty fast, but again, okay, I'm at 47% complete, that was the last time I saved, so yeah, I imagine I'm probably at, like, 50%, let's, let's try to save the game again, let's go back in here, save game, 
No, it's still just forty seven percent. All right. Well, anyway, thank you so much for joining me this week. Uh, we'll be back. I'll be back definitely. I might be joined by Ricky next week for some more Uncharted Drake's Fortune. Uh, maybe beat the game. Who knows? Um, depends on how how much other bullshit sequences I'm going to have to die through many times. Um, so yeah, join us next week. Again, all of our Let's Plays are up every weekday at 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Uh, and just as a reminder, um, we have a website, bayazonagamers.wix.com forward slash official. Uh, and if you, you know, I know that I've been saying that web address this entire week. And you're like, Barrett, that's a super complicated web address. And I'm here to tell you, if it wasn't super complicated, it wouldn't be BZG, because that's all we do is super complicated shit. Um, but if you want to help us get to a regular sort of web address of maybe just like BZG.com or something like that, uh, head on over to our Patreon page, support us there. Um, just a little shout out, because we launched this website. I'm really proud of it. And I want to make it even better for you guys. Um, so thank you so much. Again, if you are excited for Uncharted and you want to tell me how excited you are for it and have any speculation on what's going to happen in Uncharted 4, uh, make sure to tweet at me, at Benandler Chong, and I'll be, I'll be happy to tweet back at you. So thank you so much one more time for joining me today. And until next time, have a great day full of all awesome action-adventure puzzle games, much like Uncharted Drake's Fortune. Thank you.